Hey everybody, welcome to Insomnia with Nina Valdez. Tonight is going to be a quick and easy uh, vlog here because I have a lot of stuff going on in the next couple of weeks. I am doing another murder mystery um, dinner theater thing and I'm also doing a lot of um, modeling stuff with a group called Dangerous Curves STL. Um, if you want to keep up with that kind of stuff and see pictures and updates of what I'm doing, um, please follow me on Facebook. Like I said, tonight's going to be pretty easy because tonight I am um, partnering with House Party and Bushes, um, and you would usually think of them for like baked beans, but they also just have regular um, beans. And now they have a new thing, which is... Um, hummus made easy and the reason it's going to be so quick and easy is because this stuff is literally two steps you take your beans um, garbanzo beans for that particular package and then there is a southwest black bean one that I'm going to be making also and that one goes with black beans and you it's literally two steps you take your beans you drain them and you put them in food processor with this packet of stuff. So let's get into it. So I've already drained my garbanzo beans and I'm just going to pour them in here. And then I'm taking my little packet which I've cut open. This contains all good stuff. Let's see water, tahini, which is ground sesame, olive oil, garlic, salt, lemon juice, sugar, and citric acid. So that's all good stuff. And we're just pouring it in there. Then we're going to use our handy dandy ninja and just blend it up. Okay, I'm going to take a second to stir this up. A little bit because um, some of the chickpeas or garbanzo beans I guess you could call them that are down at the bottom are not traveling to this part and getting chopped up thank you by the way bushes for sending me a new spatula yay and there's our first one yum it's pretty good I haven't tried it with chips yet I'm gonna wait till the end to do that but they also sent me this cool bowl which is like a measuring bowl. I don't know if you can see that, but it measures like half a cup, cup. So that's kind of cool. Okay, now we're going to try our black bean one. Like I said, I've already drained my black beans. And then I'm going to pour in my Southwest black bean packet. This one has more stuff in it than the other one did. Um, let's see, water tahini. Uh, roasted red bell pepper. Mmm, I like that. That's actually my favorite kind of hummus is the red bell pepper kind. Olive oil, lime juice, garbanzo beans, garlic, sea salt, tomato paste, sugar, spices, onion powder, paprika, citric acid, garlic powder, and cilantro. So, all good stuff. Mmm. That's interesting looking. And we're just going to go back to our Ninja and blend this one up just like we did the other one. It went a lot smoother and blended up a lot easier so I don't even need to stir that because it kind of stirred itself. So now we're going to do the taste test and see how we like these. I'm going to try the black bean one first because it looks delicious. That is really good. Whoop. Also pretty good for a plain um, hummus. Like I said, I prefer the um, red pepper or I really like a really good garlic one. But that one's pretty good and super easy. Yum. So if you guys want something super quick and super easy and actually 
a lot more inexpensive than buying a regular um, tub of hummus at the store. Um, I would totally recommend these. Um, and you can still say that you made it yourself. So now I'm just going to sit here and work on my script and eat my hummus. As always, thank you for hanging out with me in my insomnia. If you would like to make yours as productive as mine, you can just check out the house party link down below. And you can get some free product and hang out with your friends and do cool activities and make stuff and try out cool products. Um, I love you. Try to get some sleep.